Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. You don't have to, of course, but it would really help me out in where I'm trying to get my channel to be. Okay, so happy Thanksgiving. Yes, I know that's for America, but do you know what? It's been a tradition I've done in my family for many years now. Thanksgiving and its story is really very interesting and I have absolutely loved reading into it and I spent a lot of time over the years understanding it. It was many years ago when I started a tradition in my family when I actually thought, well, do you know what? I actually have a lot to be thankful for. All of the things around me, my incredible family, I have a lot to be thankful for. And do you know what? One day out of the year, I started this tradition. Well, on Thanksgiving, which of course is being celebrated today in America, I actually do a, uh, or my mum does, we do a big dinner, we come together and we enjoy time together and we enjoy a meal all around the table as a family, being mm -hmm. thankful for what we have. And that doesn't necessarily mean to say endless amounts of money and the most luxury goods that can just be the love around a table of a good family. That can just be the memories of a time long ago, cherished and treasured and spoken about. This year has been really difficult. And you know what? Thanksgiving is a time, of course, where people come together and give thanks for what they have and for whether that be their history, whether that be their heritage or what's gone on in their family. It can mean many things to many different people, just as what Christmas can be and just as what Easter can be. For me, I do have faith and that's what gets me through a lot of things in this life. But also having incredible parents and having a grandmother who really is my world, who I've recently lost. My mum is everything to me and a best friend, and so is my father. I have incredible brothers, wonderful nieces and nephews, and a really amazing family. Now, we don't all come together for my Thanksgiving dinner, just a select few. And this year, it's been a busy one with appointments and things going on. But it will still be special, and my mum has been helping me. And around appointments and things this week, it's been quite busy. But we've still managed to prepare a really amazing, lovely dinner. So that's what we're going to be doing pretty soon. And you know what? What I would just like to say is even though whether we've had and I, I, being I've experienced loss this year, my first ever real, I've lost my aunt and my uncle uh, several years ago and that was horrific. But losing my nan, who is so, so very much to me, actually has broken me. But there are things to be thankful for still. And sometimes in the darkest of time, it takes us a lot to realise just that the small things around us and the things we take for granted are truly the things that mean the most. Just as it being, for example, I take for granted just that I have my incredible parents there to talk to all the time. Some people don't have that. I may have lost my dear Nan, but she was at 95 and she, she had a long life, which I'm truly grateful and truly thankful for. And now... This Christmas, which I'm telling myself, which will come up sooner than it will creep up on us very, very quickly now. It will be the first one she's got to spend with my granddad in heaven in 27 years. And they're together once again. And that makes me glow and that feels quite warm. And again, it's my faith that gets me through. Now, for you here in the UK, if you're watching this, you may think, what's he talking about? Well, the essence being that we can be thankful for the small things around us, which actually often mean the most, which I say very often on my channel. And in the darkest of times, there is light. So even though this year has been bad for quite a lot of people, even regarding COVID, whether it be ill health, whether it be even money, job loss, we hear so much when we just turn on the TV. And in essence, that's what gets me out of my darkest times. And actually, people have lost their lives younger than me. And I think, what right do I have to complain when those poor souls won't get to experience the things I'm experiencing right now? So with that said, yes, I may not be American, but Thanksgiving means so very much to me and to my family. It's a tradition which we've done for many, many years. So on that note, I wish you a very, very happy, safe and wonderful Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving, America. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. And you know what? Sometimes it doesn't have to be expensive. It doesn't have to be lavish. Just doing something spontaneous, loving and caring for those who mean the most to you means absolutely everything in this life. So God bless. And until I speak to you next time, take great care and I'll be seeing you real soon. Bye for now.